Okay, uh, what happened last time? Hello? Last time? Hello? No, oh, hello? We can hear you. Oh. I don't remember what happened last time. We, uh, we met with our Sherpa to, that took us to the sewers. <laughs> our Sherpa. And then we, we got down in there, and it was a, a you know, it was a rat apocalypse. Mm hmm it was uh it was a rat catastrophe there is this horde of rats in the shape of a man that came out and said i'm a rat man and i need to kill this almost he well, was me. doing some scooby doo bopping too mm -hmm. and now i have the disease yeah we also had we all had a near death experience was anybody like unconscious as they were dragged out of the cave here? Uh, uh Tark. Or no, you medicaled me to to stabilize, up. but you were un oh, yeah. you unconscious. You were unconscious. Carry me. So yeah. Yeah, we still have to rope you out of there or something. I don't remember if we did or not. <laughs> you guys like Fun. watch over your back as you pull yourselves up through the little slidey thing. And uh, you crawl back out on the street, dirty, bloody. Uh, people and animals are looking at you funny. Mm. <laughs> um, is Tark still passed out? Uh huh. Oh yeah, I'm sleepy. Does anybody have any? He's all tuckered out. Smelling salts? No. <laughs> I used. Didn't think to bring any. Wait, who did I use my potion of healing on then? Why don't you just take me home? How are we supposed to get there? Because we need to get there via smelling, and currently we smell like garbage. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, I I hope that the are there are the animals like like if I walked up to one, what would their reaction be? Uh, do they even want to be near me? They tend to to avoid you. Ooh, this is bad. This is bad. Giving you a wide berth. As I'm are as around. are everybody really. Uh, ask around. Does oh, anybody have a good berry? Is. <laughs> yeah. Hello. Uh huh. Yeah. Hello. Okay. Call of Duty's downloading. Oh, oh I just decided to interrupt. Like... That's why I couldn't hear anybody. <laughs> now it's done. Welcome back. <laughs> this makes sense. <laughs> yes, I'm here. Hello. We are just refreshing on what happened last time. Do you have anything you'd like to add? Uh, I believe I was gone for half of it, and then I died. Or was close to it. Close enough. Yes. So, you guys are back out on the streets, breathless and gross. Yeah, maybe. So what? Uh oh. So what, what indeed? Um, I'm gonna ask around and see if anybody has a good berry, per chance. A, a spare good berry. I know some uh, some smart ranger out there always prepares good berry in the morning. <laughs> you gonna chew it up and spit it in my mouth for me, or I, I'm not gonna. No, I'm just gonna put it in your mouth and use your teeth to chew it. Little baby bird. <laughs> That's not how this works. I'm not sure I swallow in my sleep, but uh, Ooh. yeah, we'll seat you up and let gravity work. Yeah. Uh, why don't you make <laughs> what kind of check you want to make for this? Uh, let's do uh, persuasion. Okay. Yeah, my natural persuasion is just fine for this. All right, let's <coughs> see it. Behold. Please, sir. Please spare a good berry. Mm. <laughs> spare a good berry. All right. Uh, I'm pointing to my unconscious friend. A bird lands in front of you, and turns into. A, an elf. Oh, oh, shit. Well done. 
Uh, uh, hi. What, what happened here? Uh, how, what what happened? Bad things. The rats. <laughs> the rats are coming. It's the rats. Uh, this man is in a uniform of the city guard. Oh, I thought he was going to say of a rat. <laughs> <laughs> rat skin armor. Uh, but uh, that how? I assume we didn't move that far away from the sewer. Not too far. Um, and I'll tell him that uh, in the sewer there's a rat king, and uh, he's he's laying claim to the whole city. Do you we have tried to stop authorization him. to be in the sewers? Authorization? Yeah. <laughs> You're messing with our city's infrastructure? Messing? No. Saving? Yes. I think you all might need to come with me. Uh, he's going to look over the unconscious body. He uh, determines that he's not in danger of dying. And uh, says, can, can you continue to carry him until we sort this out? Uh, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> Or you could give no him a good fence. berry. <laughs> Fucking dick. <laughs> <laughs> You're heavy, man. I don't know if you yeah, know that. I probably am. A lot of equipment and shit. <laughs> Plus, shit, I might be contagious. You don't know. It's true. Well, I guess you don't oh, know. Oh, yeah. He, he, he rolled a, a high medicine check. Uh, Can you see oh. the sickness? Ooh. Oh, he's got super AIDS. Ooh, good, excellent. He's he's got uh, a fever. Is what what? I, we we need to talk about this. Uh, I I would give give him a clear pass. Don't don't let him come into contact with the civilians in case it's contagious. And follow me. Sure. Uh, uh, could somebody assist me in carrying Tark? Don't look at me. I. Uh, I'll look at. I'll look at Tanis then. <laughs> I, Otherwise, I, I. Okay, let's do it. You. Uh, you follow him through winding roads. Don't really go straight. It's just kind of go in between whatever trees and whatever else is growing up uh, make turns right, left, right, right, left, left and you just you don't know exactly where you're going but this guy seems to know and he pulls up into a building that is labeled as uh, the Nightingale Guards Seem to recognize that name from something. Hmm. Interesting. Can't imagine. Uh, he gets an interrogation room ready and uh, escorts you all in, and you guys all have a seat. And he kind of just crosses his arms and, and waits for you to tell more of the story. Oh, he's waiting for us to tell him? Uh huh. I'm not going to say anything. <laughs> so am I just laying on the ground right here? Uh huh. <laughs> Tongue yeah. out. Good. Um, what kind of room are we in? It's uh, a room that's kind of just barely big enough for four of you and one of him. There's a table and some chairs. Oh. That's it. I'm going to be scrounging through my backpack looking for poaching. I think you used your potion on Tannis during the fight. Uh, yeah. He will uh, walk up and put a nice plump good berry in in his mouth, in Tark's mouth, and he just grabs no. his jaw and and makes it chews it a couple times, and the juices <laughs> run down his throat, nice. 
and uh, oh, he comes to, to consciousness. So do I have two health points now? Just the one. <laughs> well, I already had one from being stabilized, right? No, you still have no. zero. Oh, okay. All right. Huh? Holy fuck, I'm tired. <laughs> Where are we? Uh, we're in we a guard survived. station. <laughs> we're a <laughs> lovely guard brought us here and gave you a good berry. And Thank also you. wanting to know why we were in the, the sewers, which is apparently government property. Is that a massive problem? I Pest control? I don't... Uh, I don't I don't understand either. He hasn't said a word. He's, I'm like he's... doing the don't say pest control. <laughs> you Motion. have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against in the court of law. <laughs> so you do have right to well, tell you who... one you can't use what will be provided for you. Do you understand these rights? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. One, two, three, four. What is, what is the official fish. charge against us? For what? Uh, I'm conducting an investigation right now. Am and I, I, being and I hope you can comply with that. Wait, so we're being arrested, but you can't tell us what we're being arrested for? You, you haven't detained. yet been arrested, but uh, you're pretty close to it. Why did you... You read us our rights. I'm confused now. You this need to know that you have the right to not answer questions if you don't want to. But I would highly encourage you to answer questions. Well, that sounds a bit... threatening. It sounds a bit... the year that we're currently in in the game? This is what you meant to say? As in, you can say nothing, but that means you're going to die a guilty man. That's the type yeah. of world we're in. Yeah. So maybe I'm act a... like the type of person who lives here and I'm either afraid. shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm afraid. Stop quoting books that don't exist. <laughs> Were you yelling at me or you yelling at the court? <laughs> no, I'm yelling at you. Oh. Out of character, but, you know. Anyways. I, I, we're, I did not know we needed a permit to go into a sewer. Sorry. <laughs> did you see anything suspicious down there? Rats. Really big rats. It's not, not really suspicious necessarily, but, you know. Don't like them. Well, I mean, you understand that our country is at war now. Are you oh, working for? Just... Are you working for uh, the people from the blight? From what? What? From the blight? Uh, uh what's the blight? I don't want to answer yes or no because I don't know what that even is. You know, east of of the mountains, east of Halchir. Oh no! Do we do we look? I didn't even know people could live there. Have you not I've, been paying attention to the news? I've only heard legend of the blight. Look, I fella. Thought, I thought literally only monsters could live in the blight. I'm a working man. Okay, that's why I was in the shit sewers. <laughs> I'm out of time for war. I still can't believe I got convinced to even go in there. I'm a, hey, a job's a job. man when it counts. A job's a job, and we got bills to pay. You sounded very rapey, Chris. <laughs> you, I did time. not mean that rapey, by the way. <laughs> Just, uh, she couldn't say no on account of the implication. <laughs> well, that's how this interrogation's already kind of feeling like. I don't know why. Just that hinted threat there. I feel uncomfortable, sir. Are you trying to make me uncomfortable? I think he is. Are you trying to destroy our infrastructure to take down our country? Through the suit? No! no. There no, is I nothing like... more important than proper free-flowing poo. I am never going to ever try to ruin that for anybody else, okay? I don't mean to be a dick here, but maybe wooden sewers wouldn't be the best idea if you're worried about infrastructure, so... I don't know. I, I think I, somebody just, just a thought. I'm just clearing my throat to try to get, you know. It was somebody released a swarm of rats ice. in your sewers, and it wasn't us. I, it's sewers. There's always going to be rats in there. No, no, no. Yeah. These are like super rats. 
But so you're just telling me you like rats in your sewers in that amount? I'm gonna use. What do you mean in that amount? A lot. There was I'm like gonna use this issue. and then say to Tark, "Are you sure?" So that you he's start not casting right? a spell. What's a cantrip? I guess I could do. The components are basically you're doing a lot of them. Yeah, you're you're like moving your hands and saying uh, something that's, out loud. Because what's what was <laughs> persuade them? You're a yeah. M <laughs> is material. Uh, oh I no, think no, no I would be a focus. I'd be doing use... subtle to Tark. Okay, so you're spending you... a sorcery point. To cast yeah, message. on Tark, like, are you sure that he's not working for the Rat King? Does Subtle stop hand movements? Yes, it yeah. stops hand and mouth movements. Oh, that's crazy. Yeah. That's good. So, it should work. I'm going to uh, not respond. Oh, because I have, to, I have to whisper the message back to you, and even if you can only no, hear you it... Sh- I thought you could respond. Oh, well, maybe not. It says you can respond in a whisper that only you can oh, hear. Yeah. By the way, that's He's why uh, that little brother. boy never answered you because you said you can just think your answer and he thought his answer and oh. he never heard it. Uh, yeah, you're right. Nice. There um, we go. That's the pedantry. It's not <laughs> there really you go. Pedancy, the pedantry, yeah. but I do like that. That's <laughs> that was, fair enough. Fuck you. You specifically <laughs> told him a thing that didn't work. That's true. That's true. Good. Yeah, but uh, but Sir Law Officer, man, these are no normal rats. These rats could beat you in an arm wrestling contest. <laughs> these rats could take your wife. There is, uh, like, we saw one little rat guy. Like, he had a crossbow. He was a dick. He shot us with a crossbow. So, I mean, so you said you're you're being paid to do this. Who's paying you? We said now, no such thing. You said you're you're doing this for a job. Do you have to make money? Yeah, yeah I a did. dirty job. A job for society. So who's paying you? Unfortunately, I cannot say. And I'm not... Right. Yeah, I'm not at liberty to just say that. Right. I mean, why don't you go down in the sewers and you can see the dead rats and you'll see that I'm not lying. It, the the investigation solves itself if you investigate the area, which you didn't do. You just brought us in for questioning, which well, is fine. Because I had to quarantine you. You look terribly ill. Have you seen yourself? Yeah, and now you're forcing me to answer a bunch <laughs> of stupid questions when I told you I'm killing rats, man. It's, it's okay. You're, you're sorry, incredibly I'm sick. This is not admissible in court. I feel real shitty right now. I'm not usually mean. I, I feel like I'm going to puke everywhere. Possibly over other people. I don't know. Do you think I would? I would purposely make myself this way, because I wouldn't. I mean, you, you never know what kind of diseases could be out in a sewer, and you just went in there. You got all cut up, and maybe some some. You just rolled around in some shit. I don't know. <laughs> but you, so you're insinuating he would do that to himself? Yeah, that's what it sounds like. It's kind of tell tell me to it straight. What exactly happened down there? I got fucked up by a rat man. <laughs> you see these injuries? The what's, rat man. what's a rat They're man? Coming. It's more than a rat man. What's a rat man? I, it's, it's a rat king. A rat king. A, oh. Isn't that the thing where just a bunch of rats just like die because their tails get stuck together? Uh, that's that's kind really of what it. we initially thought, but no, yeah, it's it's uh it's, it's more than a swarm of rats. It's intelligent. Uh, so while we won't, weren't destroying your uh, sewers, it might be. I'm just giving that like that white guy blinking and like looking surprised face directly at Gutsra. I, I his name is Drew Scanlon and he works for Giant Bomb. Thank you. Welcome. That guy's face. Wait, he works for Giant Bomb? He used to. Huh. He started his own thing on YouTube called Cloth Map. Um. So you're hmm. telling me that there's just a ton of rats and nobody's noticed it? I think people have noticed. Have you seen yeah, that your pest control shops that. are shut down? 
Yeah. Like a lot of them? This is pretty easy for us to find. Like, very easy. Like, we walked up to a a pest control shop, asked for things that kill rats, and then they looked very nervous and said, no, leave. And to be fair, uh, it spared us. Wait, this this thing's intelligent, you said? Uh, yeah, oh yeah. Apparently we did say that. Why would you spare it? Sorry, I'm gonna lay down. Because it looked our <laughs> ass. Yeah, more did, sick. This on the table or on the floor? Split. On the floor. On the floor. I'm a nice man. On the table? Just like, uh. <laughs> With your back of your hand resting upon your forehead? <laughs> no. I'm gonna lay face down on the floor. Kind of like cradling my forehead on the tops of my hands. Yeah, if you must uh, know exactly how. <laughs> Thank we, you. We Thank didn't you. choose to let it live. It chose to let us live. It it is it has the upper hand in, in this situation. I, I find that hard to believe that some some rats can take on four apparently well you armed adventurers. Four people went all the way f- came all the way from the blight. Apparently, people can come from the blight specifically to sneak into your sewers to start a war. Hey, I've eliminated that theory. Okay, thank you. Okay. Just, just making sure. Just we can, you we initially can thought this. We can go back to the scene and go into the sewer if you'd like. Uh, the, the, just, uh, the horror stories I that I've heard no, from, from east of the mountains just have beyond edge, you know. But, uh, so... I mean... Why, whoever's paying you, like, why would they not just tell the city guard to look at it? I, I, I don't... You think guards really want to go into the sewers either? That's... We protect the city. Listen, you seem like a very, a very nice... Uh, very nice man, that's <laughs> dedicated... <laughs> that's dedicated to the safety of this homeland. But from what we can tell, this Rat King is very, very intelligent to the point to where it might even be bribing city guards. Do with that information as you will. What? I don't want any part with it. This is above our pay grade. So you're, you're know, trying you to sell work... me on a conspiracy here where a I... rat has taken over the sewers and is bribing guards. Well, it would answer the question as to why some secret interlocutor had us go down there specifically to kill it. I'm just going to raise my head really <laughs> sharply and go, Chikarkika! Oh, uh, <laughs> Chikarkika? <laughs> I just, I start Chastra. whispering, I start whispering, <laughs> You don't know about that. <laughs> well, is, I'm going to make a roll for it. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't know about that. <laughs> <laughs> what was the what was the threshold on that? Twenty? I don't know. I'd know it if it, if I saw it. <laughs> Perhaps the Rat King is from the Blight. Did you think of that? Mm? So there's just traitors in our midst, is what you're saying? I don't no. even know. How do you infer that from what I said? There's there's well, there's yes, enemy sir. soldiers under our very ground, and it's my job to take no, care of them. No, <laughs> that doesn't mean it, that there's traitors. It's not necessarily there to destroy the city. I don't think that's the point. I think it wants he, more. He very to specifically world. said this is his city now. I think he yeah, wants he, control of it. I don't think he wants to destroy it. I think he wants to just probably not be killed by people like us. I don't think it's necessarily an enemy. I'm I'm pretty sure he wants all of your smell bags and your treat bags. <laughs> oh, you yeah, might yeah, on. you might be able to bribe it with treat bags. I don't know if you're trying to play somebody who forgets a lot of stuff, but he legit said, "Tell them this city is ours now." Like those were things he said. So he is definitely an enemy. I don't know if you're purposely no. not 
as I, in, I, just, I felt like not, this is something you should know in character. No, no, no. As in, not it's not like a foreign, like military moving uh, in. It's something that was homegrown here. Okay, that's the way you that's were. saying it, it sounded more like if you just leave him alone, he'll be fine. That's what it sounded like. That's why. I was no, just it's like, more so. It's it's not an invading army. Okay. It's well, domestic. well, if if you think, oh, hold on, I I need somebody to make uh, a nice big persuasion check uh, with advantage because several of you are helping. I can do it. You, well, you, I'm not doing. I it. don't know if I'm you've been down. talking enough to be the the forerunner on this one. I'm sorry. I got a three on this. Guess All right, go for it. Oh, well. All right. If if any of the guards can be in on it. What? What? Uh, who? Who do I trust? <laughs> ah, fuck. W- w- what do I do? <laughs> trust no one. Tr- uh, trust. Trust Tannis's stoic gaze. Her few words are uh, more than enough. <laughs> so, I. What? What? What happens? What? <clears throat> how 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 do we kill this thing? We rally the troops. <laughs> or if you happen to know a professional rat hunter, that that might work too. I like how we could at this moment inadvertently stage like some anti-rat coup, getting this guy <laughs> on our side to like <laughs> start a barracks up to invade the sewers. Maybe. Uh, we don't know how high ranking this guy is. He could just be a grunt. Gets us nowhere. That's true. <laughs> this could be like a particular So, what, what are you yeah, going to do to now? Things. I'd like take to go shower. take a dip. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, probably get the poo off of him. I mean, if y'all got a bucket Andy. in the back in a well, I would just <laughs> pour water on myself. Do you not have somewhere to sleep in the city? I do, but we can't get animals to lead us to where we are because we smell awful, as I'm sure you can smell in this tiny room. How's that, by the way? I feel pretty sick about it. But I felt sick of it. We, we, we have a guy who can, who can take care of it, I think. Nice. We're staying at the the horse and heat. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. It's a pretty nice establishment, I gotta say. You know, this is like the second time we've heard that type of... Is there something wrong with that place? Like, should we know? <clears throat> I mean, I it's, it's, the name. it's just kind of, you know, like, like who would stay at a place with that name? Oh, yeah. it's just the name? We're not afraid of labels. Yeah, I don't... <laughs> I'm covered in shit and piss, so I can't really, you know... Maybe okay. even come. Do you do what? What do you want me to do? Do you want me to? Just, I might have like family or cousins who who can help, and then oh. then all of us can go in there together. What What if we met up at a later time after we recovered? Do you want me to come come there tomorrow? What if we talked first, strategized? Uh, you come tomorrow that's, to that's talk. A much better idea. Yeah, that sounds fine. If we can find our way back here. Well, I'll I'll come to you. Hmm. Cool. Tomorrow morning. Right? Yeah. Sounds yeah. good. To, come to the bridal the bridal suite is what you're looking okay, for. Okay, just don't don't mention the rats to anybody. We don't, we don't know who we can trust. I I'm with you. Okay. I uh I, I put my fist up in solidarity. <laughs> uh, he gives you a fist bump? An awkward uh, fist bump? Like, yeah, it's, yeah like it's an awkward fist, fist bump. bump. Uh-huh, it uh-huh. right, it comes right. from the top. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's like, I was like, oh, yeah, okay, all right. And uh, He gives you a reverse uppercut. <laughs> a doubt I wasn't ready for that, but okay. <laughs> all right. My, my name is, is Jeremy Jameson, by the way. Hmm. Sounds kind of sexy. 
Uh, oh we, we gotta find <coughs> Ian. Uh, oh, yeah, he opens the door and asks, like, you know, is, is Ian, is Ian here? Yeah. Hey. These guys tripped and seconds. tripped and yeah. fell in, in like a, a pile of horse shit or something. I didn't, they cleaned up. <laughs> Alright, yeah, Ian's out back. We'll, we'll just, uh, we'll get you guys a little bit more presentable before before you go okay sweet so Ian you find uh, he cast prestidigitation like seven times and nice it helps a little bit oh how's my scent bag oh no how is it <laughs> Let me take a whiff. Does it smell like smells that aren't shit, or... Uh, yeah. It's all shit all the time. The, the smell is a little, you know, under everything, but if you can... I'm back. It's better now. Okay. <clears throat> Alright, thank God. Nice. Thanks, Ian. <laughs> what a legend. Well, okay. You sure? Later. You sure it was a horse? Like uh, all of you? That's a little weird. Have you ever Have seen you a ever... horse bite before? <laughs> you ever seen a horse kick before? Yeah, Oof. yeah, that. Yeah. Oof. I was gonna say that. <laughs> and oh shit! Is Jeremy that deer like over there? ushers you away quickly. All right, I'll I'll see you tomorrow. All right, later. Mm -hmm. Is there a deer? Sure. Hey, come here, deer. Come here, deer. <laughs> and I'm gonna hold out a treat. You can call deer. I'm gonna food, hold out can. some treats, and then hold out the smell of the horse and heat. The hotel, not a horse. Are you sure <laughs> they don't smell the same? I don't. I. I don't know. All right, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yeah, you guys eventually wind back up at your place of sleeping. All right, guys, I'm going to bed. You probably still get like some some gross looks along the street in inside. Sure, you but... don't want another shower? Uh, shower? Yeah, I do. Or a bath? I don't know. Is don't there know like here. is there anything there, or is there like a bathhouse near? Uh, that we can see? the bridal suite has an actual shower. Oh. Well, shit. But otherwise, right. you can get hot water bath delivered to your room. If we play in uh, parchment boulder snippers, or how are we doing this? Okay. Parchment boulder snippers. It's parchment last. boulder shears. Oh, shears. My bad. <laughs> you buffoon. Yeah. <laughs> who, you moron. You absolute buffoon. <laughs> Who still smells the most like duty right now? I mean, I'm diseased. It ain't gonna be me. Yeah. So it's gonna be with yeah, plague break. With people here. deciding, I'm just gonna walk to the shower. Yeah, that's fine. I'm gonna just fucking. I'm. I'm take. I'm gonna take a shower. Bye. Get a good clean in. All right, you guys all get a shower. I mean, the water becomes a lot less hot, but it's still. It's not cold. It's just not. It's not nice. That's okay. I'm uh, going to sleep. I I would ask everybody before they went to sleep. Do we actually want that guy's help? I I was just kind of playing into him. I have no idea. Just just so we could get out of the situation. I'm honestly barely even able to keep my um, eyes open right now, so <laughs> you uh, you guys figured that out. Good night. <laughs> ah. ah, sorry. I'm no, also I'm just gonna uh, go to my bed. Didn't I get worked up and almost die? Yeah, I'm probably yeah. gonna. I mean, I feel fine. Yeah, it wasn't, it wasn't too bad. 
You guys can strategize while we I don't, sleep. I don't need that much. Uh, oh God! <laughs> I don't need that much sleep anyway. I just need to dumb the tablet pen. Yeah, it's time. <laughs> well, it was either try to spin one conspiracy to dodge a terrorist. I, I know. So, I know. <laughs> it was, it was our options dead. were limited. I mean, we could try and bail out, but that looks really bad to. But I don't know. Do we take him down there and just like say congratulations? Like, like what do we do if we do beat it? And then he wants questions on like our boss and like, ooh, ooh, ooh. what if What's we established the... a fake company name? Here's the thing: I don't know enough about the Rat King and what its real motivations are aside from he wants to take the city. This place could have been real pieces of shit to rats, even though they're very pleasant to all other animals. I don't know. Maybe they feel oppressed. Maybe that's why. Maybe they finally rose up and... We've got a job to do. Back. Uh, I... No. <laughs> we failed like our last three jobs. <laughs> I'm aware. I, I, I have I've, your... got, I've got an emergency fund, though, too. <laughs> you got an emergency fund, but Ipo Aji doesn't. <laughs> well, <laughs> We've got to think that's about on it. him. He's been getting... This is, this is his fault, okay? Yet again. Now, as as friends, this is a real, real shiesty job we got stuck with here. I think it's we can make this work. Ugly. We can involve the guards, and we can let the let's let's let the guard take all the credit, and then it looks really good. Like the guards, like ah oh, yeah, I look good, and then we can you know we can slink away and and get paid for a job done. Because I'm pretty sure that guy did not specify how the job should get done. <clears throat> I mean, that part's true. He probably assumed we wouldn't use guards, but he thought wrong. <laughs> God. Let's just uh, keep it small, though. A small I, amount of guards. Well, yeah, the obviously. The better. <laughs> wait, wrong. Never mind. I think he mentioned something about being discreet, but I can't remember for sure. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I think that's okay. probably... All right, good. Uh, yeah, if he keeps it hush-hush. If he thinks it's a conspiracy, good. Yeah. No, I, I think the uh, the job giver said mm. something about being discreet, but I can't remember. Yeah, he probably would like it that way. At this point, though, there's what was his problem. name? Reginald. I don't feel like. Yeah. His yeah. name was. Let's see here. Uh, Reginald was his name. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. Uh. Causing problems, breaking into his business, causing problems for his customers as he runs a protection racket. It's one uh, mob running into another. Hmm. Actually, can we? All right. I feel like this is this is our plan. Right. We need to go back to some of these pest control places. In quotes. Yeah. We need to get some real pest control things. Yeah. Well, I need to talk to some of the owners. I need to find out what what their perception is on this. I'll just cast a little bit of suggestion on them, ask a little bit, find out a little bit more. I could scare them. I, they're already scared! <laughs> nah, but even more. That's probably the um, wrong move, though. Yeah, I feel like... I feel like just a little bit of a, a coaxing, a light push in, in our direction would be fine. I think we should also have a decent cover. We we could say that we're professional uh, pest exterminators. No, 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 because they're already no? afraid of the idea of pest controls entirely. Mm. I mean, to be fair to them, if they encountered anything even close to this Rat King, I don't really blame them. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. You're thinking of the hippie shit, right? Remember yeah. we talked to the bar owner and he said, oh, fucking rats, I hate them, or something like that? Oh yeah, we dispelled that whole thought, so you don't have That's to worry right. about that. They're not, they're not hippies, yeah. Yeah, okay. I'm not super hippies, anyways. <laughs> okay. Well, in that case, huh. yeah, I think we we definitely need more supplies, though. I think having some well, yeah. fire bombs would help a lot. I mean. <sighs> Problem is, yeah, we definitely need uh, AOE uh, effects here. Um, yeah, what's wrong with lighting a sewer made of wood on fire? <laughs> yeah, sewer and poo. 
we do that, and then the guard just goes, my infrastructure! <laughs> yeah, I say, we will become the thing he accused of. And then we kill him, and then no one will know. Ah, so... Uh, mm, let's continue. So I, I love this you, plan. Terrorism and this assassination. Plan. Perfect. This is great. Uh, let's I not really do like that. this. <laughs> Disease Tark is not to be trifled with. Well, yeah, you need not, uh, you need a little bit more chill, I think. We're not. <laughs> huh? yeah, I'll just kill him. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Let's not do that. Let's say we didn't. <laughs> um, yeah, we're we're kind of in a pinch here. I think we got to play along. We do need to come up with a convincing backstory, though. Why are we here? Um, what are we traveling for? We're traveling we are, friends. We are. Uh, crypto cryptozoologists. Here we go. Uh, We've heard tales that there's quite the mat or rat migration here. Mm, we're scientists. We're just yeah. we're just following we're just, rats around. Mm -hmm. That's that's not half bad. We traveled here from the from Hippie we'll, Town. We'll call Tark like the rat, the rat scientist, since he knows all about killing rats. All right. And we are uh, we are his research assistants. Yeah, That's sure. Work. That's perfect. That's perfect. Rat migratory patterns. That's they're they're roaming across the continents, uh, going from city to city. Now the question is, could we could we convince uh, what's his name, Jerry? Jeremy. <laughs> Jeremy. Did you think Jerry from Rick and Morty? <laughs> yeah, I was like, that's how I'm kind of picturing him in my head. So, yeah. <laughs> God damn it, Jerry. Um, maybe we could kind of convince him of that backstory, too. It's not entirely untrue. It's just a stretching, right? It happens to the best of us. I think that this could work. I think this is good. Yeah. Let's roll it. In the morning before uh before Jeremy shows up, I'll inform Tark and Tannis of our carefully crafted backstory <laughs> using our real names as <laughs> our cover. <laughs> No, my name will be Arsic. There we go. All right, we're good. We're not using code names. No, it's yeah, he definitely forgot to uh, get all your names and everything. See, it's fine. It's Ooh, perfect. Yeah, it's, it's Arsic. What it's a fine. bad police. <laughs> Listen, he was just getting swooped up into the into the moment. It happened. Yeah, he's. See, if we had thought better, we would have just lied about what. Is your name just Ars right? with a K on the end? It's our son. Oh, it's, it's yeah. Kestro backwards. <laughs> okay. What <laughs> uh, an arse. <laughs> what if what if we never handed out names? We just said uh, the scientist, and then everybody else okay. is just Tark, the field researcher. Uh, mm -hmm. Will you roll a Constitution saving throw, please? I would love to. <clears throat> uh, as soon as my eyes work. <laughs> there we go. Oh, nice. You I have succeeded that. one of two times. Nice. You, you have still like to... you still have your first level of exhaustion. It did not go away. Okay. I'd like to stare at Tark while he sleeps to analyze him. Tark, right. you wake up sickness. with a voice in your head. It's yeah. Ipoaji. Oh, fuck. Uh, so, <laughs> did you find out how how he knows you guys and why he asked for you in particular? No. Yeah, he didn't mention that, did he? I so. <clears throat> and I didn't ask, did I? <laughs> It happens to the best of us. I'm just going to message back. Nope. Nope. <laughs> uh, 
No. <laughs> <laughs> Gonna kill them all. The rats. <laughs> All's good. Okay, that's it. That's all I'm saying. Uh, I, lo- I love the, the little conversations that you have. So so beautiful. <laughs> um, I should really start like sitting down, like having my character write this down or something. Like this is what I should send instead of just like, uh uh-uh, uh, mm, nope, we good. See ya, bye. <laughs> I I've got uh, a plan that will help a little, but I want an in <laughs> in game reason for it, so it'll have to come later. <clears throat> Okay. Uh, so it's morning. Everybody's up. Oh, wait. I get all my hit points back, right? Uh, yes, and half of your hit dice. Oh yeah. Just three, which means I have five. All right. And oh. everybody has spells again. That's also important. Oh, yeah. Your hit di- you should have the same number of hit dice as your level. But I think he used some the day before, so yeah, they're not all back oh. yet. Because he was fighting and stuff. I'm only missing one. It's not a huge deal. It's a very big deal. <laughs> okay, so. Uh, would you're all I assume kind of just meeting and talking in your rooms? What are you going to do? Probably rest <laughs> until I'm needed. <laughs> I would imagine that that makes sense. See if I, I should have just picked haste after all. I could have given that to you a little bit. Just a little pick me up. Basically, mm. meth of the magic world. It also it gives a, a level of exhaustion when it's over, so you could really kill Chris. No, oh, it doesn't really. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it does not do that. Oh, also, Caleb, I did end up taking ritual summoning. So nice. I don't know Are you how good? we plan to do the book. I uh, the the book because you get a book with two ritual spells in it. And then you can put more in it. Maybe so. just say you unlock like a new a new chapter of it. Okay, works for me. Perfection. They don't have to carry more shit. Yep. <laughs> oh yeah. So do I immediately? So have yeah, access in in to... your fever dream. You, you... <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> So I'll just wake up, open my book to check, and just be like, oh, I'm too tired to do this right now, though. I'm just going to get back to sleep or try. See, Chris is just now playing himself in the game. I mean, yeah, if I got scratched up by, you know, a disgusting rat like monstrosity also, and got a disease, in, yeah, poo I'd probably try it. to sleep a little bit. <laughs> Give my body some a chance to do things. What would I feel sick, or is it just exhaustion, like tiredness? Uh, it is a disease, so you probably just feel queasy at this point. Okay. Um, I'd probably go downstairs to try to eat before going back to bed. Then. Hey, Jeremy's so, down there. Ah, oh, fuck. Well, I mean, I'm not going down first. I wait for them to go down. Did he see me? Or. I mean, sure. Today we're just talking. Shit. You don't have to worry. We can tell him we can't go. Nobody until, else like... with me, or did everybody come with? For food? No. I'd, I'd go down with him. All right. Well, I would just go for food and kind of wave at Jeremy. You still look terrible. Yeah, I still feel terrible. <laughs> I'm going to eat. Or try. Can we take the food somewhere private to talk? Yeah, probably. 
Okay, let's do that. Oh wow, the the, the bridal suite. Uh, are you are you married? Only to God. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> no, I'm I'm no. None of us are. Wait, are are either of you two married? No. No. Okay. No, no we're all we're all single. No. Tannis, you don't strike me as a married man, but I'm sorry if that's offensive. Uh, <laughs> are you married? Sorry. No. Okay. All right. See. Yeah. Married to right. my work. There you go. See, we're all just a bunch of buds hanging out. Yeah. That totally knows people. Are married. What a the weird group. All right. Whatever. Uh, all yeah. right. So you go upstairs. I'm gonna eat. I'm just gonna eat off on a table somewhere. So so okay. So I I think I know a couple people. And I, I made him say, screw rats, so I know that they don't like rats. You think that's enough? Uh-huh. Do you think they're on to me? Nah. <laughs> okay, good. That's, that's probably fine. Uh, did you have any ideas for dealing with rats? We, we kind of lost our first bout with them. Well, I mean, I haven't seen him, so I does is there like something that's not as effective against him? Like should 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 it should I focus feel like on my magic? We're doing that much. How how did your weapons feel, guys? Do you feel like they were doing good work or no? Uh, I don't remember. No, not particularly. Uh, I think honestly, I know you accused us of doing us of doing just this, but uh, you probably should just consider just lighting the whole uh, sewer system on fire now, to start from scratch at this point. <laughs> fire would we probably kind be of effective. need those, you know? Do you have any sort of area of effect things? Because they're really small and, like, really fast, but also they can clump together to do big hits. It's just really hard. It's like it's a swarm of rats, it's a swarm. I mean, with a hive mind. Yeah. A lot of my natural talents are kind of uh, you know, manipulating the weather and stuff. It doesn't really work that well underground. Shame that rats just—I don't know. Maybe they get arthritis and then they just make the weather cold and they complain and then leave. Hmm. I don't think that's gonna work, but you know, pipe dream and all. Maybe we can wash them out. Can can rats swim? Yes. Even I know rats are notoriously good swimmers, which is gross. Right? Look, I, right, I, I don't study Disgusting rats creatures. extensively. <laughs> okay, I'm right. Perfect. It it sounds like we're gonna need another day of preparation, at least. If we go in Underprepared, they'll know. Um, do you, do you about... think they're expecting you to come again, or do you think they think you scared them off? Uh, he probably thinks we're scared off. He he was pretty clear on the uh, you know, the yeah, them owning the city. Yeah, I had no doubts as to what it meant. <laughs> Shit! Sorry, uh, choked on my you, food. How, how many how many rat traps <laughs> do you have? Do you think that would be effective? On like one. How many are there? Like a thousand. <laughs> so he he like was kind of like turned towards you. And he just like turns away to talk to somebody who knows what they're talking more about. <laughs> so, any, any ideas? I passed I'm the currently book thinking to Tark, the our resident rat uh, slayer. 
Um, actually, can I have a moment to confer with uh, our expert here privately? Is, uh, is there something that you don't need me to hear? No, it's not necessarily. It's just I need his uh, unabashed opinion on something. Uh, he he looks at everyone else and is like, "Do you think she's been taken by them?" Say <laughs> <laughs> so what? Mm, as far as we know, the rats don't do mind control. I, I yeah, think we're pretty safe. Okay. Uh, I'll, I'll just be over here. It'll be literally thirty seconds. I promise. One. Two, uh, three, <laughs> four, All right. five, uh, on six, a scale of one to yes, seven, how screwed are we eight, if we do try to legitimately nine, take out a rat king? Ten, no, see, rat 11, kings are twelve. Like when their tails 13, are together, and 13, well, this thing are not 15, this. All right, all right, we don't have enough time. Uh, we need. 17, so, do we abandon ship 18, on this? And just... 19, <laughs> I think twenty. Twenty-one. I don't want that to live. Twenty-two. 23. Alright, we're in. In for a penny, in for a pound, huh? Okay. 25. Alright. 26. Make sure. 27. Alright, we're good. Ah, Alright, we're back. Are you guys done? Yeah, we're done. Uh, Alright. Alright. It was more of a, a tactical reassessment. We're good to go. Oh, so we're just going in there. Ooh. Uh, no, no, no plan? Not, no, oh, no. Light. Sorry. No, but uh, we've steeled our will. We Wait, definitely you were going to, to abandon me. No, no, this was no, no, no. What do you mean you're in? Were you not in before? Was was I going to do this by no. myself? Wait, who said that? I don't think. I'll be honest that. with you, man. I was potentially going to leave because of the sickness, and they were seeing if I was still up to it, and I said yes. But one more so you day. You can't afford to have a, a sick party member, right? Yeah. yeah. But I feel he like. He's the rat expert. I feel like. Uh, I feel like I, I might. It, uh, it might pass <laughs> soon. We'll see. <coughs> They're all cool, though. It's just I was not sure. Oh, yeah. Okay. And we're totally they were seeing if they should leave without me or wait for me, and I told them. Just give me a few days for the sickness to pass. This this would be an excellent time for you to train, Jeremy. Pra- practice your uh, your technique. <laughs> practice the blade in in secret, of course. Don't, I mean, but, uh, no no offense to to any of you, right? But like, I feel like I'm I'm stronger than you guys. So yeah, I I don't know. Maybe you I guys mean, need we, to train more. We can, are can... desperately in need of somebody who's a strong front line, without a doubt. Oh, that's not that really. Is... That is definitely. I'm been more hard. like just, mess with the weather and stuff. Way. So I can really appreciate <laughs> a brave. I, and I put my a hand on his forearm. I can really appreciate a brave soldier such as yourself, as well trained. Oh, God, 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 fuck. So thank you. Uh, this breakfast food is uh, it's pretty good. <laughs> what did we get for breakfast, by the way? I uh, it's, it's, a, it's a big attention. city. You got you got a choice of whatever you want. Just say it was a spicy uh, hash brown skillet. Yeah. <laughs> Only if that's what good. you want. It's pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> Clears up the sinuses. Mm-hmm. Uh, let me... We should definitely today swing by some of those uh, pest control shops. That would be an excellent objective to complete today. What what are you going to go there for? Maybe. I don't know. They could have (laughs) things that are useful to us. Things that we didn't know we didn't know (laughs) about rats. (laughs) Uh, he turns to he said, to somebody yeah. else and says, "What are you guys going there for?" 
Uh, yeah, Tark. Why are we? <laughs> Wait, we're go. What? <laughs> you recommended the other day we check back up on the. the yeah, uh... we need to. That was before I had a disease. Hmm. Well, now you're sick and definitely probably don't want to go back into the sewers while sick. What? What if you just visited? Went shopping today. Went shopping? <laughs> what for clothes? For okay. rat rat killing um, implements. Second idea. How about I don't go? Hmm. Uh. Here's the deal. The whole rat poison thing it had good i like it was a good idea. Still, maybe is. I think instead of finding a poison or some kind of pest control implement, maybe the better idea would be to find out where these rats are getting their food, and then figure out poisoning <laughs> that later. Yeah, yeah. I I'd be careful. You know, some of some of the the sewers water gets filtered back into the drinking supply. Uh, so oh, I, I'd, of wouldn't it does. wouldn't uh, you know? I wouldn't be looking for enough poison to poison thousands of rats. Okay. Fair enough. Um. Maybe we could just put if we find out where they're eating we could potentially take out large swarms of them as they come to eat like guerrilla warfare style mm. i know i know this may be a word you haven't heard so allow me to explain i've hmm. i've heard of gorillas before perfect see we'll jump out Wait, of the bushes and beat them with our fists are. Uh, oh. He turns into oh. a gorilla. This is a gorilla. Oh, he can't say that. Oh, but uh, he just turns into a gorilla. Oh, that's fucking sweet. <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen some shit like that before, but that's awesome. Um, he turns yeah. back. Yeah, that that's a gorilla. Huh. Okay. I'm probably lost a little bit of color in my face there because it scared the shit out of me. You know, I saw one of those in a book once, and uh, doesn't do it justice. It really doesn't. That was something. I can make a bigger Thanks. one. Oh, hell yeah. I can make Please. somebody else into a bigger one. Whoa. I can't, I can't do a gorilla, I'm sorry. Like, if I somebody's really useless, I can turn you into a gorilla, and then you can punch things. Oh, Wait, man. you can turn That's one of us? Cool. That's really cool, man. See, Kesra, our friend, our... Uh, I was thinking play. more, more uh, you know, <clears throat> uh, and he, like, nods towards uh, Azon. <laughs> don't, don't make me flex Actually, on you. um, he's actually pretty good in the fight. Oh, one, one of those kind of guys. He's... He doesn't believe in having a whole lot of, uh... What's the word? Talking. Just punching when it comes to fights. It solves a lot of problems. Yeah. He's quite good at it. He's pretty damn good at it. It just doesn't work well against rats. Mm. Yeah. I'm usually a lot better, my, too. My but... mortal enemy is rats and all things small. I mean, to be entirely clear, uh, uh, Tannis in our party wasn't paying attention, <laughs> so we got kind of stuck down there. Mm. <laughs> and, you just it didn't you fake didn't work out. Had, out. Buddy, oh. had, had he been paying attention, this all could have yeah. been averted, and mm. he probably would have been fine. Uh, I'm staring extra hard at I'm gonna use suggestion to settle. Uh <laughs> no. I'm gonna use my two hands to strangle the life what out of What you're her. looking for is modify <laughs> memory, and it's a much higher level. <laughs> yeah, is that, uh, we might need that spell there. It is extremely powerful, but uh, very high level. Wait, yeah, I was say meta-wise, that's a real spell? Yeah, modify memory. Oh my. <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> Let me read up on this. 
Uh, actually, I right. okay. Um, oh, that's my suggestion. Oh, it's we it's not for sorcerers, out. unfortunately. We need to find out where they're getting their food from, and then we can strike them as they eat, and then see with enough time here. This might take like a week. Who knows? But that's the the old pest control. If we cut off their food supply by constantly killing the rats that come for food, the bigger rat guy won't be able to eat anymore because he probably doesn't come up to eat himself. He probably has the little ones carry food to him and then eats it. So at some point, he's either going to starve or he's going to come up here. Uh, uh, the coming up here part is nice for your, our new friend here. And... You know, the, the dying of starvation would just be even better. But that probably won't happen. He'll probably just come out to meet us. I have a question. Uh, Please. More game rules. So uh, since I'm not a rat-killing expert, but I've had an actual idea, would I need to roll to see if Kessera would suggest something like this? <laughs> you oh, don't have please. to if you don't want to. You do whatever you I don't, want. I don't care one way or the other. All right, well. I've heard the way you kill ants, though, is you just get the poisoned food back to the the main hive, right? Okay. Is there... Go ahead. He just, he just mentioned, like, poisoning the rats and the water potentially getting poisoned. Well, and more filters, so, so... More so, could we develop some kind of anti-psychic spell... I'm wondering if there's a Wait, something psychic. To bring it what back. is what is that? Yeah, I don't. He has psychic powers. It's a hive mind, so it's got to be able to communicate from one rat to another. Oh, I see what you're saying here. So it's a hive a mind. Yeah. What? <laughs> Basically, it's like all if all of us could share. Is there thoughts. more stuff you're not you're not telling me? I thought I it's thought like it's... rats mixed with angry bees. Yeah. Bees, bees can do it too. With their mouths. <laughs> Hold on, let me. They act as one. Is one of you got like uh um? Oh no, I got parchment and pen. Hold on, hold on. Let me grab this. Let me get this. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna borrow this map real quick. And show Tark's brilliant skills at drawing. Mm -hmm. It looks like this. Uh oh. Okay, it looks like that. Oh. Like it's like oh, this is the head area, but then all these squiggles and stuff, that's all rats. So that's it, what we saw in there. It's like Oh no. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna let's see, would I even be able to understand what this is? No, probably not. My perception skills just aren't good enough. <laughs> hey, the drawing wasn't that bad. <laughs> you already saw it, so you know what I'm drawing. I'm just <laughs> using my poor art skills to give him an idea. <laughs> yeah, imagine like... Uh... I, I'm going to be honest. I don't know if if I can ask you know, like my cousins and my family to come in on this. This seems too dangerous for them. Fair it's honestly not so bad. It's more of crowd management. And your guards. Your professional soldiers. That's all that's basically just professional crowd management. Hey, right? I, I I could have been that's a soldier. Common. I could have gone to the front lines of the war, but but I, I didn't. So It is I'm, important I'm to just have a guard. some of your strongest <laughs> No, it is important to have some of your strongest, most robust soldiers back at home. Who better? Yeah, to have I don't know, man. You'll favorite. probably be fine. I told that uh, that rat monster thing that um, its whole family was worthless and meaningless, and they deserve nothing but death. And look, he let you, me go. You. Uh, I feel like there's so much you've left out. I mean, not on purpose. Probably, I don't know. I'm sick. We do a we do a lot of 
a lot of stuff like this. It's it's fine. It's understandable, but nothing to worry about, really. I almost opened up my own rat killing business. I didn't, but I almost did. He's very good. I'm sorry, I don't. Are, th- are there lots the of best. of rats in the north? Yeah, yeah I come woolly, from woolly rats. You know, Right? Aren't they called woolly rats? I think that's what they're called. I don't know. Rats are rats. Mm, they're bad. So okay. true. So true. But yeah, I think uh, that would be my expert suggestion, is that we slowly weed them out and try to see if we can cut off their food supply. Uh, it might take, like, a week or so, but that might be the smartest way to go about it for now. Worst case scenario, more rats. Well, I, I called in sick to to work today, so I I don't I don't know if I can help you for a whole week. Might be something you have to do on your own. That, no, that's fine. I we can reconvene in like a week. We could talk about this later. But what if he finds out what you're doing and ambushes you? Uh, I won't we'll have to deal with that. Sounds like something a rat would say. <laughs> I, uh, here's the thing. Above ground, I have much better running skills than underground, so I'm a little more confident on getting away. And fighting at that. Fighting's much easier above ground than in sludge, so I think we'll be okay if the fighting's on our playing field. Yeah, you know, underground fighters, they're all scum. Yeah. Disgusting. Especially Illegal gambling and other money. bullshit. Yeah, that's awful. <laughs> yeah, I can't imagine anybody ever being dumb enough to do anything. Yeah. It's a waste of money when you think about it, too, you know? Yeah. I mean, Especially, yeah, you'll probably wind up just losing every time you have when you bet. Mm-hmm. Gambling's yep. just illogical. Is it- I'm I'm glad that you guys all think the same way as me. Yeah, it'd be it'd be a real shame if we didn't, for sure. Yeah, I think the this is definitely a good course of action here. We can. Uh, uh, what's the best place to reach you? At? We can like give you a, kind of a a report at the end of the week on the goings ons. Um. Well... Never know. We can meet in a public place if you don't want, like, us being tailed to a house or something. I don't know. Not that we would let that happen, but I could see yeah, the Yeah, you, you might concern. just have to, to write a, a letter and uh, hand it in to the, the, the right. guards. Uh, make sure it's sealed, and that should be good enough. We'll probably use some coding, you know? Like, we'll talk about the harvest instead of the rats, and we'll kind of oh, do it like that. So you'll you'll have to kind of decipher it that way, but we should make it easy enough to where it's obvious, just not... Okay. I mean, yeah, it'll be obvious to you. <laughs> um, and just try to give me, like, advanced warning of, of what day... You need my help to fight because I might have different spells available on my normal work days than a day that I might do this, if you understand. Okay. Fair enough. We will make sure to give you advance notice. Thanks for your help. Okay. Good Good luck out there. And it's good to find. And s- s- screw, screw the rats. There. Yeah, screw the rats. Sounds like well, I mean, to kill them, but not screw them like... Well, you get it. Alright, he, he leaves. <laughs> Alright, there you guys go. Okay, <coughs> so now we either contact him in a week or you don't. Whatever. I'm gonna go to bed. <laughs> <laughs> Long rest. <laughs> And then when I get to my room, I'd probably pull out oh, the book and then probably get to uh, 
doing the familiar business. You will need some uh, high quality incense and other stuff in order to oh, cast a spell. Really? I forgot I have to go buy that. What was that? Is this like 10 gold or something? Uh, yeah, 10 gold, charcoal, incense, and herbs. You also okay. need access to a brass brazier. Okay. Um, second plan. Uh, I'd probably just try to cast the Unseen Servant instead. And... Yeah. You, After it, you like, summon an unseen servant. You feel a strange <laughs> presence of pressure in the air. But you can't see it. Let's make it pick up some shit. And then when I see it doing that, I'm just going to be like, neat. And then I'll go to bed for the moment. Nifty. <laughs> <laughs> well, what if this is just a, What I if this is a... Yeah, what if this is just a chronic illness that you'll have? <laughs> I'm just insane. <laughs> we'll take none of this is happening. <laughs> uh, ooh, that moved. Don't worry, guys, I got this. <laughs> yeah, that's it for me. I'm just going to rest. So you honkies are off to your own devices. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> I called you clowns. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Taking it back. <laughs> sure, sure, sure. He's tired. He didn't mean to say that. <laughs> I don't believe it. He just, his sleeping pills, you know, sometimes it makes you say things. White <laughs> fragility aside, uh, <laughs> you guys should do something. <laughs> Is is there any secret anti-rat task that you wish to accomplish? It is still fairly early in the morning. Still before I, the uh, I want to go check on more pest control shops to see if they're getting shut down in some way. I wonder if the Rat King is either intimidating or forcing out of business pest control places. I think I'm sure... I'm sure the Rat King is guess. keenly aware of his enemies. I'm gonna, like, really quickly kind of hop up and be like, oh! And then open the door of the bridal suite and be like, hey! Did y'all do me a favor? There's like a What's glass that? of water floating behind him. Don't mind that. Um, the, okay. Ah, shit, let me get my thoughts together. All right, all right, I got it, I got it, guys. Um, uh, I need some shit if you're going out. Like going out? Or like, I mean, maybe. I, I need some, I need some materials. If you know what I mean. Why? Are you talking like lotion and Kleenexes? What are we talking here? Well, he needs some. Jesus, some, what are you insinuating? <laughs> I'm not that high class. Need some adult parchment? I mean... <laughs> adult parchment? <laughs> you know, it's like writing parchment, but on the sides it's like, got like gilded like outlines of naked women. <laughs> you know, like the trucker flaps, but it's like going across the edges. It's fancy Jesus, paper. Alright, what I need from you guys... Oh, man. Is, uh... I need mm -hmm. I, okay. I need some like charcoal, incense, and herbs. Okay. And I also need like a brass brazier. Has to be brass. Just Very just a brass important. bowl. Yeah. You make your own fire. I I need to set shit on fire for a spell. Okay. I'm not being weird about. The, I need to. What kind of spell? Uh, it's a summoning. Yeah, it looks like I'm summoning a, a little creature. I mean, is, is it good right? or bad? I mean, the way... No, it, I'm pretty sure it's a familiar. Like, you know. You're pretty sure? Yeah. You sure this is a good idea? <laughs> I know what I'm doing. 
I hope it's not a rat, but okay. It's not. Yeah. Oh, I can't believe you would suggest that. Hey, look, man, we can't control the things we summon. Uh, which one is close? That's actually a false statement? Yeah. <laughs> I feel like that's wrong. I don't know how to summon, but... What, what do I know about summoning? Which one of you would be closest to the door here? I don't know. We're probably all equidistant from the door. I mean, like, roll for it? I don't, I don't know. Sure. Well, I, I guess... It's Tannis. All right. Uh, who's second closest? What? <laughs> it's me. It's still Tannis. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's still Tannis. Oh, no. Yeah, it's definitely Tannis. Come on. It's <laughs> you. Yes. 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 <laughs> I think it's Tannis. <laughs> God, so, Tannis was in a superposition of being furthest and closest to the door. I was just moving constantly as he kept like he yeah, was he's looking, like trying to look past looking, you, and I just kept going. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna shake my head and then like shake my head like <laughs> seeing something, and then just walk up to Tannis, slap him sixty gold, and say, "All right, here you go. Take care of that." Yeah, when you go out, thanks. <laughs> okay, can you write down what you needed? Oh, sure. Um, I'll write that down. Thank, thank you. Okay, <laughs> I need charcoal, incense, and herbs. Good smelling herbs, like mint and shit. Not actual shit. I'd say you've already covered in shit, so you should be good to go. Ten gold worth of that. And then a brass bowl Something I can burn shit in. It has to be brass. And yeah, hopefully that that should cover it. I can't imagine it won't. I swear to God, if you get a copper pole. Yeah, no, it needs to be brass. I guess we're going to the hippie shop. Did you write all that down? He did. Yeah, Yeah. here you go. And then I'll give you the parchment. I'll scribble on that. Charcoal, incense, and Is this a normal parchment? This is adult parchment. Remember, copper whatever bowls. paper, whatever paper I uh, bought at. Let me see. Do I have it listed? Note paper for notes is what I have. So I guess paper, and I'll just give him the whole paper with all the notes I've had, which includes like, um, basically the stuff we talked about with the rat dude. And then I'm gonna say, oh, if you could pick up more paper, that'd be great. <laughs> So I can write things. <laughs> he, he's tired. He doesn't know what he's saying. Just, just, yeah. just let him go. <laughs> and then I'll just walk back in my room. I pocket the sixty or the yeah sixty gold, right? Yep, yep, sixty gold. All right, you guys all heading out then. Are you splitting yeah. up to do your own things, or are you going to tackle them as a group oh, one by one? Uh, sticking together is probably a good idea. I gotta make sure y'all get copper and not brass bowls. You motherfucker. Are you, are you an expert in copper and brass? <laughs> yes. Alright, well, since we basically just need incense sticks, let's just find the nearest record store. <laughs> <laughs> uh, ooh, I have a good idea. Is there? Well, I need to look through our smelling bag and see is there anything that uh is clearly a a made incense, not like a flower. Um, hmm. thinking. Good question. There's uh like a a sprig of like pine needles. Sure, let's try it. I'll find it. Try to find one of the nearest animal guides to take us to where this smelly pine is. 
uh, easily enough the uh, uh, we'll say it's a chicken <laughs> and it leads you to a intersection where there are several pine trees growing uh, what's a uh... What what do I see on around these intersections in terms of businesses? Um, there's a blacksmith. There mm. is, uh, like a lot of craftsmen. Um, there's like a like a tanner. Uh, and there is like a little street stall. That has mm -hmm. uh, incense, sure. All right. Does this incense seller also have charcoal? Uh, I do not have charcoal. I would imagine he would, because many incense are made with charcoal at the base. Yeah, but Jeez. I need this charcoal for the incense so that it can function. That's that's too true. Too true. I don't have all my. I don't make it here. You know, I just sell it here. Hmm. Wait, how much? How much charcoal did he say we needed? Because the I incense told you and like... herbs was ten gold worth, but that includes charcoal. Yeah, every, it, it's generic. It's. There's like if you go to a magic ah. shop, you can just buy a bundle of everything you need, but you didn't go there, so you're here. Yeah, mm. I was wondering why you didn't just go for a magic shop to begin with, <laughs> especially you since been. you've been to one already. <laughs> Look, I'm not a magic caster, I punch things That's hard. That's true, that I is punch true, things really hard. How much incense do you want? Uh, who has the gold? I do. All right. How much incense do you want? How much did he write on his list? Ten gold. He worth. just wrote ten gold of charcoal. I need ten golds worth of charcoal. Oh. <laughs> no, no, I wrote charcoal, incense, and herbs on that same line. Yeah, but he, just, he could read it like reference. a programmer. and He could if he wants, but... <laughs> Just making sure he knows what I, I wrote. <laughs> I, I'm already regretting Chris's decision to put, make this my decision. <laughs> um, you can... Do, do you want all of the charcoal? Or all of the incense? Because I'd I, I give you everything for 10 gold. That'll probably that'll probably work, right? I mean, it's incense and charcoal and herbs, right? If it's not, I can come back and buy him more. Okay, I read to me exactly what is on the list. Type type it out. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, I can do that. <laughs> yeah, uh, I know exactly you go, me... what he's. <laughs> me, uh... Let me type that out for you. That's what is on the paper, basically. All right. I would like three go four gold of charcoal, three gold of incense, and three gold of herbs. I don't sell charcoal. I sell incense. Uh, maybe I, maybe the blacksmith over there I might be able to help you. Wait him to sell me some of his, some of his uh, uh, gold or his uh, his charcoal. <laughs> Can you repeat that? Can I persuade him to maybe sell me some of his uh, his stock that he uses? Uh, roll for it. I mean, you could just buy extra incense and, and throw and give the incense back to me. I suppose if you're if you're paying for it anyway, whatever roundabout way you need to make this right, let's, 
I just need four gold, <laughs> three gold of incense, and <laughs> make it happen. You will have a repeat customer. Oh, oh, okay. All right, all right. And they just started like pulling out all the incense, and some of it he grabs like a little tiny knife and snips off charcoal bits and like scoops it into a little like small wooden bowl. Uh here you go. May God bless you, whichever one you believe in. Well thank you. Open minded of you. What a it hurt to say. <laughs> <laughs> so now you just need herbs, right? right? Tannis is a human, right? Uh, yeah. Kind of, maybe, <laughs> to be decided. Yes, Tannis is a human. Uh, Odin's blessings upon you. Odin, ah, uh, yes. My favorite of the sociopaths. Have a good day. <laughs> <laughs> and I scoop up my shit and I leave. After I give him the gold, of course. Oh, I forgot a line that's on that paper. Oh, Christ. Uh, also paper. <laughs> yeah. Well, the yeah. paper I wouldn't have written down. I just told you, so oh, if no. you forget, it's, that's whatever. But I did. I would have wrote brass brazier. Yeah, that's what the copper. 50 gold is for, right? Yeah, I don't know how much it costs. I just kind of, like, looked online, and oh. there's Pathfinder. There's one that's 50 gold. I don't know how much you'd be in this. So <laughs> I just put a bunch in there. It's awfully ballsy of you. I also uh, uh, didn't ask for change back if you call, so, you know. <laughs> you figure Ooh, out how best to save money on that. That's all. We stopped <laughs> by a... He didn't say the size of the bowl he needed. I didn't. So what if we got him, like, a really small one and then saves the money? <laughs> like, a really, I like, a tiny one. I will give him the biggest brass brazier. Brazier? Brazier. Brazier. Brazier that I can for the fifty gold that I have. Oh yeah, this this corner right here has uh, some blacksmiths and craftsmen, so we could just commission one. We could get a delightful brass bowl made if they don't have any on hand. Also, <laughs> do you remember I told you I was summoning a a creature? So, I mean, yeah. You know. Yeah, so? If you don't know how that works, maybe someone else does. No. We yeah. don't. I don't think well, any of us know how that works. Yeah, that's fine. Alright, so so you walk it up to the blacksmith, or you're gonna search around? I'm gonna... I think I'm gonna browse the craftsmen first. To see what they have in stock. I assume craftsmen are just like have all sorts of like weird knickknacks that are handmade and like other like stuff you need. Oh yeah. What do you wish you could find? A brass bowl. Uh I mean you can get like a hand size bowl that could be brass. For uh it's it's a little decorated, so it's ten gold pieces. Hmm. Are there any other options? Not in just like a general arts and crafts store. Hmm. Hmm. Assuming he wanted to travel with this, it would probably need to be travel sized. What if, what if we got him one that was like a big, like a big saucer, <laughs> like technically close to a bowl, like a, like one of those, uh, like pans you use for when you're when you're trying to pan for gold, <laughs> but made out of brass. <laughs> I mean, it'd be it'd be pretty flat and fit in his pack, and he could wear it as a hat or something. <laughs> Of all of, of all the things, this is what's taking the longest. <laughs> well, we just listen. We just bullied a street vendor. We just bullied a street vendor. Okay, 
I bullied no one. I fully... Uh, it was consent. I paid the man. Yeah. Okay, sure. It was a transaction. It was. <clears throat> We should, we should get him. We should get him an ornate bowl since he's sick and all, you know. So a little gift. I will get him whatever bowl I can for fifty gold pieces, as long as it's brass. <laughs> I think we just need to go straight to the blacksmith then. Then let's go to the goddamn blacksmith, like we've said six fucking times. You got the money. You can just leave poor yeah, old yeah, yeah. days on behind. You're waiting. His yeah. brain is addled. The blacksmith, onward. <laughs> Inward, if you will. <laughs> Wait, no, we don't want want that I need a, a brass brazier, the biggest you have for 50 gold pieces. What do you want a bra for? <laughs> Fucking idiot's gonna do that. Damn it. I... <laughs> <laughs> they didn't have bras back then. Did they? <laughs> Video. Yeah, I don't know why he. I need a. Has I he never seen Brunhilda. It's, it's strange. I need a big brass bowl. Okay. <laughs> you want this one or this one? Which one's bigger? Uh, there's one that's about. Just make sure two, one's deeper. Two handful no size. <laughs> and another one that's like shoulder shoulder width. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh yeah. Give me that shoulder width, boy. <laughs> He's gonna use this as a buckler from now on. <laughs> That'll be 25 gold pieces. Uh, how much is the other one? 15. I'll take them both. Wow. <laughs> wow. And pay you 30. And that would be 40 gold pieces. All right, have a good day. <laughs> I leave. <coughs> we'll give some other are... troll our money. No. If, we, oh. we live in a society. We can barter. Oh, and this wow. man what has a... the balls to up me on the price from the start. He, we, there's no sign around here saying prices are final. Oh. I'm not going to have my chain yanked. Onward! <sighs> to the other blacksmith. I'm saying this all in a tone and a volume that can be heard by the blacksmith that we just left. Yeah, hey, go fuck yourself. <laughs> <laughs> and in a very childish tone, I'm going to turn around and say at least I can get fucked. And then leave. <laughs> Wow. And I am using my performance skill. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm mimic throw... his fucking voice. Oh good. Let's hear it. Oh. <laughs> I'm just throwing my hands up. Is this is too much. Where's the cigarettes? <laughs> I'm lactose intolerant. Uh, <laughs> oh, I'm speaking gonna... of food, I need to get a drop of molasses so while we go to the other place, I can I'm going food. back to that craftsman shop and buying that that tiny little ornamental. Kestra, bowl. you have an arcane focus, so you do not need material components if you oh, do not true. want. Okay. You can also just abandon you. that and get a little pouch. Ah. Okay. Focus. How how much was that little tiny ornamental bowl? That was ten gold. I'll I'll buy that for for him, the small one. You just gonna sneak away and the then tiny little grab a yeah, tiny I'll just bowl. Do it real quick. Wait, I'll how much time did you say it was? Ten gold, ten gold for, for the tiny bowl, bowl that's ordered that's like decorated. Oh okay. I'm gonna go to a different blacksmith. All right. Hello. Hi there. What size? Uh, brass bowls do you have? That's a weird request. Really? In, in today's day and age, brass bowls are a weird request? <laughs> I'm not sure I have brass bowls. <laughs> Alright, Forrest Gump, have a good day. <laughs> okay, who's, you too. Who's Forrest Gump? <laughs> On to the next blacksmith. 
That was all the blacksmiths in eye shot. <laughs> all right, I'm going to go back to the hotel, toss in his shit and his money back, and say, there's no brass bowls here. We'll have to find another way. Shit. Uh, I oh, hand him a uh, small uh, baby ornamental uh, bowl. This, sh this should work, right? It's perfect. Maybe. Yeah, I'll try it. Thank what kind guys. of designs does it have on it? Uh, you know, just like swirlies and, and flowers Aww. and stuff. Nothing menacing on it? No. Good. <laughs> but darn. Fucking... Is it menacing? <laughs> Did I buy a demonic bow? <laughs> I, was hoping I, I was hoping I bought him a cursed bowl. Mm. Well, that I'd probably get to work on casting the spell... Uh, you're not sure whether that smaller bowl will work, but you basically just have to burn the stuff to find out. Yep. Doing it. So you He's put doing. the charcoal in the bowl, you put the mm -hmm. incense in the bowl, and you light it. And the herbs. What herbs? Are there not herbs here? There's no herbs oh. here. Shit. Alright. Wait, no, did we forget yeah. the herbs? It was just an incense shop. Oh, motherfucker. This... I'm that black news reporter right now that's sitting there screaming about sick of this po-dunk fucking town. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> it's cool. It's cool. He should have been specific on where There's we should There's always tomorrow. There is always tomorrow. Where Where did you guys go? Hell. Uh, <laughs> just around, you know? We followed a chicken. I, I guess don't use the we chicken. We followed chicken. <laughs> <laughs> okay, out of context. <laughs> this is the, so chicken, the chicken stupid. was a jerk. He, was, he probably led us to the wrong area, you know. He led us right, right to the jerk shopkeepers, you know. Ah, okay. I'll keep using deers then. I guess they, they haven't steered me the wrong way. Yeah, that would be that a steer. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, well, I'm like gonna to try to go cast. back to sleep. Oh, well, I have my herbs, so I can't. Uh, it's not bad. Actually, I don't know how I'm gonna feel. I... Get I'm, hydrated. I'm gonna go take a walk. You know, get I'm hydrated. Go get some herbs. <laughs> I'm gonna go get some herbs that are legal and used for spell casting. All right. Do you have like a specific thing you're looking for? An idea. I mean, it's not specific with herbs, so I'm I'm thinking like minty shit because I like the smell of mint. So like uh, like going reason. to like a food kind of place. No, I probably still just go to a magic shop. Do you want to go to the one that you've been to before? Yeah. All right. Uh, you looking for herbs? Yeah. Can I ask what for? Yeah, don't worry about it. Is this medicinal? No, I, I'm, I'm fucking. I need the. Need to uh, conjure a familiar. Oh, That's... do you want the full familiar special? Oh. Yeah. How much is that? How big is that? Uh, well, I've got you a large brass bowl here. I can get some incense, some charcoal, some herbs, all for, uh, let's say, 40 gold pieces. Or if you just need refill, refill packs, we can do that too. So looking at the bowl, does it look comparable to the one I have? Uh, it's much larger. Mm. All right. I'll buy... The pack. You said it's 40? Yes. Alright, and then I'll buy two refills. Okay. So 60 all together? Sure. Sweet. That's not how math works. Okay. Quick math. Yeah, you failed me there. Alright, cool. Uh, you know, in case you're to new to this, you know, 
like a like a brazier. You know, it, the spell works a lot better if it's off up off the floor. So you know, like use use a table or, or something. Yeah, I'm sure you'll be fine. Can I do it indoors? Is that a problem? Uh, uh crack a window. All right. Sounds uh sounds good. Thank you. And then uh, I'll go back home. Okie doke. And, uh, yeah. You, you thought, as like, when you first came outside and on the way there, that the outside air was doing you good. But by the time you're heading back, like, all the smells and everything is a little overwhelming. And you just want to mm. go back to bed. Yeah, I'll do that. I ain't gonna light a fire and upset my stomach more, so it's bedtime. I will continue this in the morn. <laughs> in the morn. <laughs> it's Jason Morn. Anything else anybody <laughs> wants to do on that day? Because that, that really only took um, probably a couple hours. It's still like early ish afternoon. I'm gonna go around to. The I want to try and find that one pest control shop that we went to that the owner was like really skittish. Uh, because the one was closed down, or actually, I want to find the one that was closed up. Can you make a survival check, please? Sure, but I can't promise it. Uh, it worked. Wow. It worked. By some miracle, you kind of remember the general direction, and you go back to that closed down shot. Alright, now, is it... Was it boarded up and, or something like that? Uh, yeah, or mostly. the door was closed? Um, I, is there, like, a back door? I think you asked this already. And I wanna... the answer I was no, I think. Yeah, I Are think it windows? was no. Are there windows on the building that I can peek through? Uh, you can, tr you certainly can, but just because of the nature of how it's closed up, you just kind of be obvious that you're being nosy. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, a roll perception, please. Is anyone else with him? Eyeballs, go. Did anyone else come with you or did you go alone? Uh, if nobody wanted to go with then I went alone. That's fine. I don't think I would. No, I wouldn't have gone. Alright. Uh, yeah. You know, there's like uh lamps and torches that look like they haven't been lit um are there any signs of disturbance in the like the floor or like is there like is it look messy in there there there's not like a thick layer of dust there is all of the the stuff that that like would have lined the shells and stuff is all just gone. It just kind of looks like empty. Hmm. How boarded up, or is it is it just like the front door is locked, or is it boarded up? The the door is locked. Shoot. Um. Are there people around? Uh, yeah, I mean, there's people around, kind of. It's the afternoon in a large city. You also notice uh, there's a rat across the street on the ground watching you. Oh, boy. Huh. <laughs> A little spooky. I guess this guy could have just gone out of business or, you know, maybe he's taking some time off or something, cleaning house. 
Uh, I'd like to. Is there a shop next door to this one? Sure. I'd like to walk inside that one, and I'd like to ask the shopkeep what happened to the pest control shop next door. Oh, uh, he had to leave town. He had to leave town? Family emergency or something. Family emergency, huh? Well, all right. And then, uh, I'd like to go to the store that's on the other side of the pest control shop and ask him the same thing. Uh... He he he's very ill. Uh, I I don't know if he's gonna be opening back up again. When did that happen? Uh, sometime this month, you know. Sometime this month. Can you remember the exact date? No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's okay. I don't remember stuff. That's okay. <laughs> and then uh I wanna go is there a shop directly across the street? From uh, the best yes. That's the the final stop I'll make. Okay. And ask. Hey uh what happened to the shopkeep, the pest control place? Uh I I think uh just Failed, failed business. Failed business. Ninety percent of all. Not, not a lot of people, or uh, four years. Bad choices. Uh, what, what did him in? Well, I, I, I think you know, just too, too specialized in in one thing. Sure, 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 sure. Are there any other pest control shops in town? I don't know. Have you seen anything weird going on in the past month or so? What do you mean? Mm, you know, like your other shop sacked and weird. You know, less customers, more customers, weird customers. Rat customers. Uh, would you like to buy a cake? <laughs> I could buy a slice of cake right now. Um, a whole cake for myself is just... Oh, <laughs> it's a bit much. Oh, so you don't have any friends. Okay. As a monk, I practice a lot of uh, self I, I, uh, You know, uh, some of my friends, they're on a diet. You know, I, I don't... I, don't I, could, I can't do that to them. You know, bringing a whole cake in front of them. It's really... <clears throat> I, I don't want to talk about pest control what about what about like pets do you, do you have any pets like small ones no no do you like squirrels <laughs> or other small furry rodents do, do I think you need to leave <laughs> sure this is a cake shop my bad <laughs> And, and I'll leave, and uh, I'll try to find another. I'll wander for a little bit without using the thing, just to see if. I'm also. Are there any pet stores in this shop or this town? Have I seen any? Um. Not in the sense that you might expect. Um. There's no shops that sell animals. But there are shops that, like, would advertise as pet stores and, like, sell food and toys Surprise. for animals. I would be interested in visiting one of the pet shops. Okay. And I would like to ask about uh, uh, an uptick in, uh, like, bird seed and rodent food being bought. Uh, I mean, small pets are, are recommended for first-timers. What about rats in particular? 
seen a lot of uh, a lot of hubbub around those small, fuzzy, friendly creatures. I like how you're more of a detective now <laughs> than your last character. Oh my god, he's, he's doing more detective work than this <laughs> detective character ever did. You ended up killing everything before I could do anything. <laughs> you you were asking stupid questions when you went to ask questions. It's because I had other ideas in mind down the line. <laughs> that way. <laughs> to be fair, though, this uh, this one in particular seems more uh, troublesome and complex than some of the other ones we had. Well, I mean... I I wouldn't say there's That's... been an, an uptick in, in sales, exactly. Hmm. Has there been a decrease in sales? Have less people been wanting furry friends? Why don't you make a... As pals? Either a persuasion or an insight check. Let's do insight. It seems like he knows something. Um, it's not that there's been a decrease in more that it's something else. Hmm. Have you noticed any rodents out about in the wilds a little more? I mean, you know... Seeing them out on the street a little more than you might use. Is this about our, our warehouses? Warehouses? I mean, I, rats probably like to take up residence in warehouses. Is that weird? Is there, there a problem with rats in warehouses? Uh, no, no. No problems with rats in warehouses. Nope. No. Hmm. Would you like to buy anything today? Perhaps I'll be back. Have a nice day. Oh. Alright, I leave. And I'd like right to down? write down the name of <laughs> yeah. the store that I was in. Did you have a spider crawling on? <laughs> Whoa! I'd like to write down the name of the store that uh, I was just Why don't you, yeah, you write down uh, Smart Pets. What's it called? Smart pets. Ooh. I went to drag owl onto my character sheet so I'd have like a reference of the owl, and it said, "Are you sure you want to turn this character into an owl?" And I was like, <laughs> "Well, no, I'd rather not." <laughs> uh, I'll I'll head back. Do you want me to make you a new character sheet? Uh, yeah, that'd be helpful. Uh, I'm going to head back to the hotel and tell them. Thank you. Tell them what? I'm going to tell them Soldier Boy. that the closed up pest control shop that I went to, all of the nearby businesses all had different reasons for him closing up. I didn't really question him that much. And then I decided to visit a pet store to ask about uh, any uptick or downtick in rats. And the one that I visited uh, asked about a warehouse, but it uh, didn't seem like he wanted to talk or so I was hiding something. It's called Smart Pets. I figured maybe we could tell him. Maybe he knows. Or maybe somebody a little more uh, beguiling could ask them the right questions. This is your investigation. <laughs> Mine, but this is a team effort. <laughs> but you're doing it so well. <laughs> if, if things need to get punched a lot, I'll do that. <laughs> But, uh, I mean, 
Kessera and Tannis, uh, you you both got the the silver tongue there. Uh, I'm sure you could. Less uh, one would, extract one would like to think, but it doesn't always seem to work out in my favor. Hey, maybe, maybe you if you bend luck a little bit, you know, maybe it will work out more. Often. Yeah, maybe if I maybe <laughs> if I was born with their capability of literally changing right. fate and whatnot, that would have made it easier. But you know, it's not like that actually exists. So. It's, Look, I'm just, I'm just saying, we could maybe follow that guy. We could ask him. We have options. You said you're summoning. Do you, is he gonna do the summoning while I'm away? I'm sleeping. Oh, okay. I came back and went to sleep. <clears throat> or at least I'm trying to. I don't. Maybe we could use our our druid cop friend as a a ruse in the pet store. Could transform into an animal or something. That is true. I don't know. Hey, Zon. Uh, Specializing thing. What? You're, you're quiet. Out. I kind of specialize in this sort of thing. Uh, trickery, subterfuge. Yes. Talking. All of well, the above. I I think he <laughs> knows. He mentioned a warehouse, which sounds awfully related to the job we're doing i didn't get a name because that's not what i do <laughs> he wasn't wearing a name tag otherwise i would have read it i'm good at reading <laughs> <laughs> years in the god i can read from 10 feet away you'd be so impressed i have, el I have elf eyes <laughs> you were the one that got paid the most right yeah yeah, yeah that's right for reading and scribing smart boy not, Big brain. Not not people smart though. That's fine. That's fine. What do we want to do? What should we do? Are you still here? Still obviously very fatigued and not coming out. I should still be in my bed sleeping. I'm curious about his sickness that he has. Can I do like a medicine check to see how like if it seems to be getting better? Would you be okay if I did that? He's I'm sleeping, sleeping so, so yeah. You're I'm sharing a room really with him. To get consent. Just don't check his uh, temperature without waking him up first. I'm, 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 uh, I'm, like, I'm, like, I'm like staring at him to try and gauge him. Whew, goodness, that was a cool. Uh, thing. Yeah, roll for it. Yeah, with my eyes. Also, do a stealth check to make sure you don't wake him while you do it. Oh, I don't care if he wakes up. <laughs> I don't care. Uh, you can tell that. His body seems to be fighting it, uh, but and it seems to be making progress. But there's still an element of danger, and it doesn't look like he's exactly getting restful sleep right now. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe we need. We can also find a cure while we search for our rat troubles. But uh, what a day it's been. <laughs> All this scrounging around and all of that stuff. Oh, yeah. When uh, when Tark went to the magic shop, did he end up buying the, the full summoner kit or the refill? He bought all oh, the full all and two refills. And two refills? Yes. Do I see his kit with like the brass? Yeah, there's a big bowl on the table. <laughs> <laughs> you feel emasculated. <laughs> I'm I'm slightly disappointed, but I'm gonna I'm gonna let it be. Don't worry, you'll you'll be happier when you see me summon. There's a reason I bought extras, my friend. Don't worry. Um, I don't think I have anything else I need to do that day. Do you guys have anything you need to do? Not all. No. Nothing. So you spend the entire rest of the day 
started lounging around. I mean, I don't want to get sick either. Rest is good for the soul. A new day comes, I suppose. Uh, Tark, make a constitution saving throw. Hell yeah. Hell um, yeah. Let's see it. Let's open see my it. character sheet. How's that owl coming along? Oh, it was already open. Damn, dude. Nailed it. Nice. Man, I feel better. Just for, for narrative's sake, um, you, you feel like relief, but you haven't gotten rid of the exhaustion yet. Okay. But, but yeah, you're no longer queasy, and you feel much more active. Excellent. I'd probably say hi to everybody else and say, feeling a lot better. I'm probably going to eat and then see if I can summon a demon. Not summon a demon. <laughs> mm. Mm. I mean, I Shouldn't be a I problem. Do. It's that's just what a I joke. do right after I wake up. Yeah, I'm just like, ah, I am a wonderful a pure... day to summon something. No! Time to talk to old B.A. Ah. Hey, I'm a very a curious, curious soul, okay? Y'all, y'all are calling me weird. Look at this cat summoning apples and pears and stuff. <laughs> apples and pears. What's he gonna summon with those herbs, huh? Other plants. I'm cur I'm curious. I'll I'll be watching this. This seems interesting. All right. Well, I'll eat and then get to it. I will also partake in the watching of the oh, uh, yeah. the Hellspawn form. I don't know anything about summoning, but I am definitely intrigued. Yeah, me too. <laughs> uh, if you I guys could leave the room for one second. Uh, do you have to take your pants off to do this, or what? <laughs> one of those summonings. I Is forgot to change uh, my undergarments, but I'll be done in a second. Magic <laughs> pants? Urban underwear. Ooh. He just pooped himself. No, I just... Just get the fuck out. Okay? <laughs> sure, 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 sure. In one second. Can we do this in the bigger room, actually? <laughs> uh, sure. Uh, right. When they leave, I'll, like, look over my book again to kind of prep for this because sure. I don't really want to have it out in the open uh, I while you. I do it. And then <laughs> I'll go back in with the stuff and then I'll kind of put the smaller bowl that Azon brought back on the table and put the stuff in it and then get to work. Let's see if it works. Unfortunately, as it burns and you spend a whole hour and ten, and minutes. ten minutes meditating over it, uh, you feel the charge and release of magic energy, but there appears to be no effect. Hmm. All right, let's try the other bowl. And then I'll get right to it. Mm. Mm. I have a question for you out of character. Uh huh. Obviously, you selected an owl because you wanted to like fly around and scout and stuff. Yeah. What if it doesn't look like an owl, but it has the same stats? Oh. The it only like trap. other thing I would think is probably some other type of bird. Because I would imagine that would make the most sense for my character to know about, or at least have had contact with. Right, but I I, I was more thinking of something associated with the book and your background. I mean, I, that's fine. Okay. Go on. So, uh, you go through the same axe, consuming even more charcoal incense and herbs. <laughs> And uh, now the room is very... <laughs> there's a nice little layer of smoke on the uh, ceiling. Ooh. Good. Uh, 
but as the ritual completes outside out of the the brazier comes a little flying lizard hull oh shit an oxycoddle what is this i think it's oxycoddle <laughs> hey little buddy <laughs> I see you've you've summoned a hairless rat. Yeah. What is that thing? Hey, now that's not a hairless rat. That's like I don't know a lizard. <clears throat> it's pretty cool. Huh? You guys got something against lizards? I just want to know what that thing is. I'm not sure on the particulars, but I mean it's a magic summoning, so oh, it makes sense to me. Versus the normal summonings. Right. Uh, yeah, you know. You know, with the dog tree, <laughs> that's what I do with the normal summonings. Oh. Come here, dog. So the dog shows up. <laughs> every time. Uh-huh. Well, there you go, guys. That's a summoning. We all learned something today. <laughs> I, I didn't it. know what that was either. That uh, was so exciting. An hour of chanting. Two and hours. And waving and... Uh, yeah, yeah, two hours. Two hours and twenty minutes. Thanks. Of of that, for... I may have had to walk away, like in between, to the room <laughs> to change my pants again, and then come back. Yeah, you know, <laughs> just to make sure they were gorgeous. on right. Oh, so, look, uh, I, I by the way, sure I got lucky pants. After immediately after you finished that, which is a little late for Ibuaji, so he must have been busy. Uh, yeah. He, uh... I should know. <laughs> No, okay, I'll say it now. Um, he he asks, uh, so you don't know how he knew Kesra's name? Wait, who did? The our benefactor. Um, oh, what's his name? I'll Reginald. just turn to them and be Reginald. like, Ipo's asking, like, how he knew. Uh, Kesra's name specifically. I mean, we didn't really ask, did we? Isn't she no. famous? I just assumed she was famous. My fa- my family is. I don't know how much they know me, but that's a bit worrisome. Yeah. You know? well, I'll just let them know we don't know. And then I'll say, yeah, we're not sure. It slipped our mind at the time to ask. Unfortunately. Um, uh, yeah. That's it. Uh, so now you have a little flying lizard friend. Nice. Uh, it can't climb walls like a normal lizard can, but it can fly around and stuff like an owl can, kind of. So. so it's like an evolved bearded dragon. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> bearded dragons can't climb good because the claws and yeah, yeah. Hmm. This picture kind of works perfectly, so I'm stealing it from the internet. You can't just steal from the internet. Would you download? That's where you're wrong, kiddo. Would you download an oxalotl? <laughs> yes. A hundred times yes. Is that what they're actually called, though? Those are the ones that are, like, amphibious. Okay. Yeah. Oh, does it look like, uh, like, Kukulkan? From Smart? Yeah. Uh, yeah that's what I'm imagining. I mean, I was just imagining, like, a gliding lizard more of a thing, but... Oh. Gliding lizard. Yeah. I, uh, I got a good... Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, all right. Yeah, okay. Except but those can things can, can climb, but, you know. That's why, that's why I found... It's actually kind of hard to find, like, a cartoon gliding lizard for some reason that doesn't look, like, weird, so... Um, we're going to do this for now. <laughs> I'll probably keep looking, but it looks cool. 
Not exactly what I was imagining, but I just need a token. Uh, I just searched winged lizard clip art, and there's some like dragon looking dude that looks badass. How's this? Oh, let's see. Oh, that's, yeah, that's cool. Yeah. It's pretty cool. Yeah, which post it up? It's, uh, his. Oh, he. Nobody else can see it. There you go. Oh. There you go. Huh. I, I dropped that's the token cool. for you. Oh. That, there's my token. It was great. That's a good <laughs> token, too. Aww. Oh. How cute. <sighs> With the shape of it out. <laughs> nice. All right. Yeah. Is there anything who who would like to accomplish some progress today? We should, as a whole team, go over and visit that pet store. Sure. sure. Or would it, I would might it make be more sense? Would it make more sense for just just one person to go in and try to work their magic instead See, of a whole bunch of people being intimidating? Here's the deal. Now that I have this little lizard friend, I think I think I might be able to like. Hold on. I think I could see what it sees. Pretty see sure. What I see. So, like, you guys could take it in with you, and then I could, like, sit outside and relax while it runs <laughs> around. You know what I'm saying? Sure. Why do you need to relax? <laughs> I can't. <laughs> I don't think I can move while I'm looking through its like senses. Uh, oh. Huh. Yeah, it'd be like having two brains, and I'm not used to having two brains, so I'm gonna have to sit down. One. <laughs> <laughs> Am I right? <laughs> Ooh. Oh. Wow. Oh, really? I want to give you an inspiration for that. <laughs> 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 God damn it. We've it's got perfect. 20 minutes to use it. <laughs> no! <laughs> Alright. That works for me, though. I'll, like, find a bench outside. <clears throat> <laughs> Sit in, the, in some leaves somewhere. I, I don't know. Whatever passes for a rest area. Are there benches in this town? I, I'm hoping, sure. but... Yeah, close enough. There's like little stone, like it's like potted plants that you can kind of just like lean against and stuff like that. Perfect. <clears throat> so the three of you go inside. Wait, who's all coming? Uh, he knows I was the one asking, so I will stay outside with uh, I'll stay outside with Tark's body. Oh, right, yeah. You can't really go back in. I guess yeah. I'll have my familiar hop upon Kesha's shoulder, since she's not really going to be doing most of the talking, I don't think, right? Probably not. Tams has got maybe not on the shoulder, but maybe on her back. Alright, so I guess I'm just... confused. As I thought we were tailing this person. Uh, we never decided what to do. I just had that as an option. That's true, you guys just kind of watched me summon shit. <laughs> yeah, well, I figured that the tailing could be... Well, I don't know, because then after the fact, they might get suspicious, and then not. That's true. Then yeah, we can, we can wait until night. We can just walk by this shop, and I can show you the shop I'm talking about. Hmm. You know what, let's just go to the shop. <sighs> Okay. All right. We'll do it live. Yay. You two can do it live. I'll be looking oh. through the familiar then and just watching around for any rats or whatever on her back, like out of view of the shopkeeper. Okay. Um. So you guys, the two of you, go inside? Yeah. Can I help you find anything today?
Well, yes. Uh, <laughs> me and uh, my fiance here are thinking about getting a pet. And I've heard that you have the finest pet store in town. Well, I would certainly be glad to help you choose what might be right for you and uh, be happy to sell you any equipment that you might need. Exciting. Our first fur baby. Oh. <laughs> I'm probably Can you tell me about any of your, your interests? What do you two like well, to do together? Oh, nothing. Oh, boy. What do we like to do together here? <laughs> we're, we're very independent people. We what do don't we like to do? <laughs> are, are, are you guys at home often? Uh, no, we travel. <laughs> oh, okay, good for travel. Okay. I, I like something that can ride upon my shoulders. <laughs> and it's not me. And then I do like a really horrible wink. Okay, well, I'm, I'm, I'm <laughs> leaning, leaning for something reptilian right now. You know, a little bit low maintenance. Ooh, ooh. Uh, I'm not a fan of, of scales. Uh, I'm more of a fur man myself. Okay. No feathers either. He did say fur, baby. I did he, say he fur, did. Baby. He did. My apologies. Uh, I understand that's a very loose terms in these trying times. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> uh, you're banned. Mm. Uh, pardon? Um... <laughs> I'm what? Okay, so, oh, what? Hmm, well, you know, common common pets like cats and dogs aren't aren't very very good for travel. Uh, you know, they need plenty of rest and plenty of attention. And if you guys are independent and traveling a lot, that might be might not be something that suits you. Also, something maybe uh, hard, maybe like a, a ferret. Those tend to uh, smell, don't they? Small, a small rodent does sound quite nice, though. I, it does have a, a ring, have a, a ring to it. Yeah. Uh, okay. If only there were some kind of shorter, squatter ferret type creatures. It is like like a like a mouse. Uh, I worry that a mouse might get stuck. Like if he falls into a. a I'll spot my pack. It might have to chew its way out, and then I'm out of backpack or a satchel. Hmm. I, I need something that's got some heft to it. That so, yeah, something uh, hard, hardier than a mouse, sure, smaller, sure. smaller than a ferret. Hmm. And before you say anything, uh, I had a small accident as a child, and uh, hamsters are out of the question. <laughs> I, I was I was since. just I was uh, just getting the hamsters. Mm. That's, uh, a, that's a better way that story ended than I thought, dear. Thank you. Uh, what about uh, a, a rat? Hmm. You know, I never thought of having a rat as a pet. What do you uh, do? You what do you think of rats? Do they make good pets? Oh, I bet they do. Uh, you, you know, rats are loyal <coughs> and intelligent. Yes. <laughs> the, the these are true statements that you're spouting. I I agree. Yeah, yeah. Would you? Would you? Do you think you would want me to help you find supplies for for a rat? Then. Um. Hmm.
My only concern with rats, and and maybe you can alleviate uh, this fear. I I worry about their intelligence. <laughs> Do you think that uh, the rats are, are capable creatures? I I've heard that you can train a rat to do almost anything. <laughs> almost instantly? Almost anything. No, I'm saying almost oh, instantly. Okay. I'm going to change my demeanor. Uh, and I'm going to slam my fist onto the, the table. <laughs> and uh, I am going to... Uh, say that uh i'm just i'm just gonna shout uh the the rat king is <laughs> testing your loyalty and right now you are failing uh like when you, when you slammed his your fist on the table uh like he jumped uh but we jump. as uh, yeah, as you say that, uh, he, he goes pale. Uh, and, uh, um, I'm I'm sorry. Would, quick question. Quick question. Uh, the Rat King. What size was he? Well, he's medium, right? Like you're asking asking me out of character. Are you asking him? Out of character. Oh yeah, he was a medium-sized creature, like about he large human size. Now this is a uh, purely your decision. Um, can I transform into the Rat King? <laughs> <laughs> oh lord! My, my racial trait of change appearance says as an action I can transform my appearance or revert to natural form. Has to be someone I've seen. Can change every characteristic other than size. Have advantage on charisma deception checks if someone suspects my ruse. Oh my. I, I would say it's difficult so I would give you disadvantage which would cancel the advantage. Because you have to like concentrate a lot more to keep the form moving and rising. Oh, so like I'll change my appearance and then he gets we like my deception versus whatever you yeah. would use. Okay. Yeah. Uh then I'm going to slam my fist down and uh scream kneel before me as I, I use my change appearance and turn into the rat king. Just tra just transform the top half if you're standing on the side of a counter. <laughs> <laughs> Oh fuck! Oh, oh fuck! Oh, Big bucks, fuck. no whammies. You got Dice plus ten. You got plus ten. Ah! <laughs> Good shit. Uh, he like panic snaps to the door to see if like anyone else is nearby, anyone else is in here, if anybody else is walking by, <laughs> but then immediately regrets it and just like falls prone on the ground, like prostrating himself. Please, please. I, 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 I did everything you asked, please. Tell me, what have you done for your king? <laughs> I, I, I left all the food in the warehouse exactly like you told me. My rats have come back hungry. Are you sure it was the correct warehouse? You, you've taken almost everything we have. I... I we don't get another shipment in until next week. I, uh, the, the, the table that I slammed my fist on earlier, uh, is it a table? Uh, it was more like a counter. Is there a table nearby? <laughs> Do you want to flip it? I do. I would like to flip it. Uh, there's something flippable nearby. 
Uh, is it like toward, like walking towards the door? Is it in that path? If you like something to be in that path, sure. As I, I walk towards the door and I flip the table over with one hand, and I stand over uh, the gentleman, and I say, uh, "Do not fail me next time." Or uh, my my friends will be moving in, and then I transform into my Tannis form, and I say, "Come along, dear," <laughs> and I wave goodbye. <laughs> both both Kesra and um, Tark. There was this, the change that he went through um, is much more complicated than a standard disguise spell. Hmm. Um. I. Yeah. I'd probably return to my normal scheduled vision, uh, vision yeah, instances. Yeah, just all four of you probably meet back up together outside on the street. I'd ask him, so how'd it go? Uh, let us keep moving. Quickly. Okay. <laughs> okay. Walking and talking. I'm, I'm secretly quite impressed with the uh, transformation. Uh, as we walk back, uh, I kind of walk to the front of the pack, uh, and I'm just gonna, like, kind of keep looking back to make sure we're not being followed, uh, while also taking, uh, several false turns before we make it back to the hotel. Would you like to roll a perception? Sure. Um, I'd also have my familiar kind of flying above... All right, you can have your familiar role perception. Uh, where is its perception? Uh, just make a wisdom check if it doesn't have proficiency. Wait, did that work? Yes. Oh, nice. It's just try to change the name. Just no, n- make his name Owl. <laughs> yeah. Oops. He's oh, really there we go. Rattled. I found it. I found it. <laughs> Well, that was... I already did that. All right, so. Tannis, you don't really notice anything uh, that f- makes you feel worried about being followed. Uh, your, your familiar returns to you, Tark. Mm. And it, it feels like it, it has seen something. Okay. Uh, does it have a general direction that can point me towards? Kinda. Like, mentally, not with its body. Uh, it takes back off, and uh, does like a low sweep near one of the alleys. And Hmm. you see, like, a rat, like, stand up and try to swipe at it as it flies over. Okay. I'll just kind of in a low voice say, yeah, there's a rat following us. Okay, then I will uh, take us down a side path, like another alleyway, and then patiently wait uh, for it to peek its little head around the corner. Uh, uh, or maybe I you might... you look around the corner and you notice the rat isn't following you. It is just sitting on the street watching everything. Do I see any other rats watching us from in the alley? Um. No. Okay, then uh, I guess we'll head back to the hotel.
back to a horse and heat. Mm. Following the animals to get there. And it is close to midnight. So we'll stop the madness there. I'm not sure what happened, but we're all here together, and that's what matters. <laughs> Goodbye. That was beautiful.